Alrighty guys, you know what time it is? It's hammer time. Ouch. I'm going to pause this for a second. That hurt my finger. Almost got my finger cut off, but I got the motor off of there. At least one of them. That one, I don't know if I'm going to take it off. There it looks like there might be another screw. Uh, and then it'll pop off. But uh, real reason is I got that loaded up. And ready to go to the back lot is why I brought you along. So uh, let's go take that back there and check out what I got back there. So holy moly. My file just got a lot bigger there. Whoa. Nice. Drink it all in. There's a screen, another screen door I need to tear apart. A motor. If I can uh, get it off of there. There's... A computer up on that grill over there right over there in that tote and a few other things I'm here to unload what I got on the back here and then uh, yeah Wow that's awesome the ignition for the mower is back here in that box. I don't think it's uh, gonna work back there unless they got it wired in directly. So, or yeah, back here. Sorry, I wasn't looking at the camera when I was pointing. But yeah, let me get this one loaded and uh, I'll bring you back in a second. Second loads on there. The door fell off when we were loading it, and I gave a friend of mine uh, that computer to uh, see if he could get it going again, and uh, so he can have it to use, uh, and he helped me load this, so now I just got to go unload it, and uh, we'll see what's back there now. So stay tuned. Oh, and my buddy brought me another microwave back here. I got to come back here one of these days pretty soon and tear it out, tear the stuff out of it that I want. But there it is behind the lawn. So I figured I'd bring that, bring it in for that. Uh, I can't talk today. I must be tired still. So, all right. I'll uh, talk to you in a few. All righty. All offloaded and ready for another trip. When I uh, get another trip around, I got to get two motors off of the, or, yeah, they would be considered motors off of the uh, one dishwasher and then I don't know what else is over there um, that dehumidifier might just end up coming back to the back 
I don't know if there's any goodies in it. I'll probably save that for tomorrow to bring back. So if anyone wants to give me any insight on what's, if there's anything good except for a motor inside of a dehumidifier, um, then I'll take any advice I can get from anybody out there. And then I got to break down that screen door. What else? I don't know. There's so much up there. And then I got to talk to my buddy because I'm going to see if we're going to make a run. Um... On Thursday or Friday, and if we are, what all we're going to take, or see if he, he's going to want to do it on Saturday, I don't know, that's the thing, is I don't know, but, uh, yeah, I'm going to get back to the house and get some more stuff done. So, stay tuned, and I'll be back with you in a minute. Well, I'm kind of glad I tore into that. Look at that, copper radiator. And then, we come to the back side, and there's a nice copper line, and a big old compressor and a metal box with a whole bunch of wires in it and then a motor up here yeah buddy that's the way to do it i thought she was a dehumidifier because she had a collection tank on the bottom but uh i'm wondering if that was one of the new fame dangled uh, uh ac units and then i still got another one over there and another two back there to all tear down before uh, we go in. Yeah. I got my work cut out for me, guys. Woohoo! Alrighty, guys. To finish this off today, there's that motor that came out of that vacuum. Um... These two came out of the dishwasher and tomorrow we're going to have some fun with some coils because uh, I'm the Saza because I'm going to use the Saza and cut them all down and at least two of them and then I'll have two more to do. <clears throat> but yeah, I got that receiver I need to take inside sometime soon. Oh, got to take that engine off of there. But other than that, I mean, let me back up here for a minute. Other than the dishwasher still being here, which is going to be taken back to the back tomorrow. Um, that AC staying, the table, I want to go, I want it to go inside, so... I'm going to probably drag that inside here shortly. Um, but I'm starting to get a handle on things around here again. I still got a massive mess back there by the grill that I got to clean up. But all in due time, I am done for the day. I can't do no more. Even though I've only been working at it a couple of hours, I still can't. I, I just... My back's killing me. My finger's killing me. I just can't do no more today. So, 
it's all going to be put off till tomorrow uh, or a little later tonight. Uh, I might do some more cord cutting and adding to that hoard. So, um, yeah, until the next video, everybody stay happy, stay blessed, and most of all, love your family. Don't ever forget, love your family. Even if you don't get along, love your family. Because in the end, they're really the ones that are going to be there for you the most in your times of need. <clears throat> and I'm not talking about, like, cons I don't necessarily consider just blood family like we got the same genes or so whatever i'm talking about friends and that being family like we're all but one big happy family and if we can't get along then what's the point of being on this miserable earth i mean that's really all there is to it but again stay blessed don't do anything I would do because it might be wrong. I mean, my, my hand isn't getting any better, my finger. So, I don't know. It, it, it probably did break it sideways. And now it's pretty much going to be healed back sideways, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, I'm going to stop rambling on and... I'll talk to y'all tomorrow or later tonight. Depends on what I'm going to do. I might do a cooking video later because I told everybody, I told a couple of people that I was going to do a cooking video. So if I do, stay tuned for that and I'll catch you on that one. Bye, everybody.